10 seconds 5 seconds start mr vice chairman i welcome the bill that has been brought before the house to remove one of the greatest difficulties experienced by law graduates it is really a sad commentary that though the advocates act was passed only in the year 2011 government have had to bring in as many as 3 amendments within such a short period and my fear is that government will have to bring in more amendments if they want this act to work well i will presently point out the difficulties which will be experienced in the working of this act we are now discussing the third amendment at the time when the second amendment was being discussed in this house my feeling was that the government would have to bring some amendments very soon and my fears like those of other honorable members have come true i am afraid the government will have to bring another amendment very soon my submission is that the government ought to have brought a more comprehensive amendment to the old advocates act i have no objection with regard to the change in the date of course that was most necessary but with regard to the rule making power of the government certainly i feel that it is a retrograde step as a member of the bar council i know that our bar councils are not working well i do not know the conditions of other bar councils but as far as my state is concerned the bar council is not at all working well when the advocates act was enforced and the new bar council was created in madhya pradesh and when we first met the advocate journal rightly said that it was a great day for the advocates that the advocates were their own matters that they were makers of their own destiny that henceforth neither the high court nor the government would interfere in the affairs of advocates but the experience is that our bar councils is ridden by factions regionalism groupings and all that as far as the difficulties in the present act are concerned i would point out that there is provision for training now the government is taking power for making rules they should make it clear what training they are going to give as far as we are concerned it is difficult to give training to the law graduates there is provision for a disciplinary committee as far as madhya pradesh is concerned the bar council has formed a committee of five advocates i am also one of them but the difficulty is that the five advocates belong to distant places and they cannot meet the provision is that all the five must come together and decide the thing otherwise even if one is absent the whole proceedings will be nullified under the circumstances the disciplinary committee had not met so far and i am sure it will not meet any time in the future also there are so many complaints against the advocates according to the advocates act neither the high court nor the government can go into those complaints it is for the bar council or the disciplinary committee but the bar council finds this difficult the members cannot assemble and they are busy lawyers too they will not find time to go into the complaints those complaints are lying and they are being filled in the high court's office there is another difficulty that there are some complainants which are old namely those who came before the act came into being neither the high court can entertain those complaints nor the present bar council can because according to the definition in this act an advocate means an advocate enrolled according to the advocates act so this council cannot take into consideration any complaints filed previous to the act so this is another difficulty my submission is that the amendment which the government is bringing now is only a half hearted measure 
I would request the government to go through the whole matter taking the views of the bar councils and also taking the views of leading lawyers and then formulate new amendments or at least bring a comprehensive law so that the advocates act will work well otherwise it will be useless because although we were told that we were the masters now we find ourselves helpless of course the fault may lie with the advocates also or the bar council but the government must come forward and help the advocates and remove the anomalies which are pointed out there are other anomalies also but this is not the time nor the occasion so i am not dealing with them now as far as these amendments are concerned i welcome them they were long overdue and when the second amendment was being discussed there was a suggestion that further time ought to have been given but the government was so ridden by red tapism that it always acted on the advice of the officers